me wonder who you might be playing with makes me wonder who morning happy tuesday all right so some of my amazon stuff came in i'm gonna open it now i need to hurry up and clean up it's early though i have a client at nine o'clock it's like 7 15 7 20 so i have time but you know i don't like to feel rushed um so so far all that came in was my pillows and i thought there was definitely more just because of the small package that it came in but it's obviously shrink wrapped and then some of the pillows are pillow covers cute isn't it pretty oh i love it it's make sure you get some good pillow covers so that you don't have to throw out your actual pillows it's a waste of money See if it gets bigger than this. I hope so. All right, so I thought that was going to be much bigger, but that's okay because I have a, another pillow that's going to go in the middle and that can just go right in front of it. There's a few more things that's supposed to be coming in today. So um, let me just open up these blinds. So I'll be able to you know, fix up a little bit more stuff and piece by piece, we're going to get it together. Look at how sad my tulips look. And they I've only had them for a couple days, but I feel like part of the reason is because they were out there with no light. I don't know. They look so sad. Well, I'm gonna get some new flowers anyway, but it's time to make some coffee. I have such a headache and I've been like having these kind of sinus headaches. I, I think they're sinus sinus headaches. It feels like a sinus headache. Um, so I don't know if that's because I need my coffee in the morning or if I truly just have a sinus headache. So we're gonna see after I sip on some coffee how I'm feeling. I have three clients today. First client is a classic fill, a classic full set, and then I have a light volume fill, and then another light volume fill, and I might have a brow wax somewhere in there. I feel like I saw that um, in the middle of the night, so I gotta double check, but I'm going to record as much as I can record today. So I'm all set up and ready to go for my first client. I just gotta close that door, put those flowers back, and we are ready to go. So yeah, I most definitely have my schedule mixed up. Not fully, but somewhat. So I have a classic full set, a classic full set, and a light volume <clears throat> fill today. So yeah. One of those full sets is a new client, so I'm gonna get out a consent form for her. I need to put the completed set form back in my folder, in my accordion file. Um, I just use a generic consent form that I printed off of, was it Pinterest? I believe Pinterest. Again, I have consent forms that are personalized. I have not printed them out yet and actually I'm glad I just thought about that because I have to print those paper those pictures off for the photo wall so I might as well print out some more consent forms and that's exactly what I'm about to make a note and make sure I do in my little Glymed notebook pictures as well as yeah and i'm gonna just chill and watch a little bit of youtube until she gets here strong mommy chrissy she's a queen so what can i say to you that i'm lost at 
had to fall back. You got everybody thinking of I just finished up my first client. I'm about to go put this on the chair in the waiting room for my next client who's at 11.15. So my next one is a full classic set, another full classic set. So I'm about to go set up for her. I need to place an order today, like really bad. Alexa, pause. I need to place an order today for some supplies. Um, I'm so bad at inventory, it's ridiculous. So we gotta do better. Whew, I am done with my last client and girl it got hot I feel very oily um but that's okay I also got some deliveries in some of them were instacarts and then the other two are amazon I'm still waiting on one more delivery so I'll show you guys what those are tomorrow because right now I gotta run out and get my kids um the instacart was partially for here and then also for home because I want to I want to make this, what is it called? Like a homemade hamburger helper. So maybe I'll show you guys what it looks like when I am done cooking it. But it looks so good. I saw it on TikTok. <laughs> so I'm like, I want to make that tonight for dinner because I think it's something the kids would like. I know I'll like it. Um, I don't eat meat, so I'm going to substitute the ground turkey for me. Whew, I'm out of breath. Substitute the ground turkey with uh, Gardein beefless crumbles for myself. So I think that'll be good. See you tomorrow. Good morning and happy Wednesday. Um, we are here nice and bright and early. I ran very late this morning. So I'm kind of just a little all over the place. Definitely need my coffee in a minute per usual. And of course I dropped the remote. Definitely need my coffee in a minute per usual. Um, I have three clients on the schedule today, I think. And I don't even know who, what, and where. I'll figure that out in just a moment and I'll let you guys know. But for right now, let's see what time it is. Alexa, what time is it? Good morning, Candace. It's 8.05 a.m. Okay. I have an hour before my first client comes. I am going to just, I don't know if I wanna wear my hair out or up, but I was hot yesterday and it's gonna be like 70 today. So I think we're gonna just throw most of it up. And then this little jacket thing is definitely coming off because oof, I was so hot. So I got the windows open, I still, need to go and get my fan I have not done that um so at some point maybe today I might stop over at Marshall's and see what they've got Walmart has them too in Target obviously but Marshall's be having the cute fans for um a good price so all right so this first one is from Lost Artistry. Love this brand. I get my L Curl lashes from them and sometimes a few other things. Um, but a lot of companies don't sell L Curl for whatever reason. Um, I only have one girl who gets L Curl so far, but I'll be trying to convince the girls, especially the hooded eye girls, um, to try L Curl. So I got the Ultra Dark. This for ultra dark I love their packaging and then 0.03 L curl and mix in a mixed tray so I got that and I also grabbed their lash map book and this is actually a good guide to like show your clients um, or give them ideas on what they might want for their eye while doing their consultation and, you know, obviously making your recommendations for their eye shape. Um, but this is a good visual. Alright, next two boxes are from Amazon. I'm not opening that big box right now because I know what it is and I will show you guys later once I put it together. Uh, and hopefully it's everything I think it's going to be. Okay, so this is the hardcover planner. See, they said 
they said, I love this. Um, they said that, um, what am I trying to say, you guys? That the sizing wasn't right, but it's perfect. And I don't know if that's just because it this stretched um, onto the spine, but I don't mind that at all. So this is the hardcover. Freaking love these. Um, I'm about to set up for my brow wax. Might as well, right? Or was it a lip wax? Hold on, let me check because it might have been a lip wax. For this episode, we're up with worse than 5 million in the same plus thanks to diving. Get on this board. But I have this coffee, listen to Way Up With He, um, Angelie's podcast, which is on now, and wait for my client. Well, turns out my first client is needing to cancel for some sort of emergency, so that's always annoying. Um, why do I feel like one eye is fuller than the other? And I feel like it is. I could touch that up later. I don't have time right now. I mean, I have time, but I don't feel like having time right now. So now I just have my brow wax and a light volume fill. Um, yeah, that just annoyed me. Oh, so actually, what I'm going to do right now is open up that box, see what's got, what's going on. So here is the new lash cart. I am going to give a review in a moment. Look at that, look at that. I'm gonna give a review in a moment, but first I'm gonna put everything up here and let you guys watch me um, put it together. You are you get what you pay for, let's just say that. Um, it's not terrible, but we'll talk about it, hold on. So here's the height difference between my other um, rolling cart. It's not a huge difference maybe like two inches um the other lash cart is wider this is very flimsy you guys all right so first of all on two of the wheels um that were falling out i wrapped tape around them and i was able to get them in and stay in however when i was trying to push down on one of them it cracked so i am going to request <laughs> a refund or of some sort um I'm going to keep it, right? If they send me another one, I'll switch it out. Or I'll just use it for my other one. Um, but yeah, I'm a little, I was I'm always a little disappointed. She's leaning a little bit, so I'm definitely going to request a replacement. It's that back wheel, so I'll know not to, you know, try to force it in, but be mindful if you do order this. And that is look, what it looks like on the side of my lash bed. Let me just go around. So that is what it looks like over there in the little corner. I think it's cute and we'll see how long she lasts. <laughs> Alright, so because I'm impulsive and I have time, my next client doesn't come until 1130. It's 10 o'clock now. A, I'm gonna go grab me a bagel because I am so hungry. I'm so hungry. And then B, I'm gonna go run into Marshall's really quick to see if they have any faux plants in there. Um, I'm really liking the vibe of 
my space right now. It just feels warm, cozy, and just elegant. And that was exactly what I was going for with the plat, you know, with the splash of girliness. And um, so yeah, let's see what Marshalls has. Yeah, I know that's my favorite store. Every time I turn around, we're at Marshalls. I do like TJ Maxx too. Marshalls is just, I wouldn't even say it's closer to me. They're about the same distance, but I think Marshalls just so happens to be my go-to. Um, but now that I'm thinking about it, I'm trying to think if Marshalls would even have, you know what? We're gonna switch it up today. We're gonna go pop over to TJ Maxx really quick and see if we can find a faux plant. And we're gonna let TJ Maxx tell us what we need. Okay. All right, so I did not record in TJ Maxx because I was on the phone with my cousin. Alexa, pause. I was on the phone with my cousin, um, but I did get a few things. So let me show you guys what it's looking like now. How cute, right? So I got the plant. Um, I also got this little table because I needed something to fill in the space. And the brown brings some more warmth in. This I thought was so cute. And I have something similar up front, but it's black. So that was cute. I got another rose ganache candle. That's one of my favorite candles. It smells so good. And then I also got this carpet, which was on clearance for $20, you guys. So once I do that gallery wall and I decided I'm not painting it black, once I do that, it's going to really bring this area together. This is the focal point when you come into my treatment room. So from the waiting room, coming in, your eye goes right here. I love it. Happy Thursday. Today is Thursday. It is almost the end of my work week. Two more days. Um, well, technically, tomorrow is the end of my work week, and we'll get into that in a minute. But today is going to be a little bit different because the two girls that I have coming in today are specifically for my photo shoot on Sunday. So this will be a cute little content day. I am going to record them for sure um, and maybe get some cute content in. But um, I'm still not positive. Like I know kind of what I'm going to do with one of the girls. The other one I don't really know for sure yet until I see her here because I haven't seen her in a while. Um, so I just want to like take a look at her eyes and maybe we'll do like an analysis with her and see like what she wants. And the whole purpose of this is to get a photo shoot for work, but also, um, to have like different lash sets and the photo shoot is not necessarily just for lashes. Cause as you guys know, I do a multitude of things. So I just wanted it to be just a beautiful, like clean, um, timeless and classy aesthetic. All right, so I took my brushes out over there and I've got my fan charging because it was dead, dead last night. I think I'm going to go run to get me an orange juice and a um, bagel. I'm hungry. Um, so I might go run and do that. I should have just did that before I came in, but I'll be going too fast for my own good. I just love how that came out. I think it looks so pretty. I cannot wait to get the pictures done. I just need time to sit down and do it. That's my issue. So, um, actually, I do have time right now. So maybe I'll sit down and at my laptop or my computer and start designing those. I did do a few already, but um, and then some of them I just want to be shots of my girls. So. And I don't want to order anything because it just is 10 times more expensive. I can't afford that. And you know what? We got food at home. We're in the Okay, so I got to record my last client. I, I technically recorded both, but 
um, one of them, her eyes was pretty red. Well, her eye was pretty red and um, irritated because she hasn't had her lashes done in so long. And she was a little bit sensitive to my glue. So we didn't end up doing her after, which is fine because I will get pictures and videos on Sunday. But I'm so appreciative because she brought me flowers because she saw on my Instagram story that I posted about my sister's birthday, her heavenly birthday today. So I thought that was really sweet and I'm so appreciative and grateful for that. I'm about to head out now. I'm kind of running a little bit behind. I go get my kids and today is a beautiful day. Today is a beautiful day, so I might take them to get ice cream or something, but let's go. Morning. <clears throat> it's very early. It's 722. I'm on my way to work now. I just had to make a little, ooh, these potholes. Just had to make a little detour real quick. Um, it's a rainy day. I still got to do my nails. I'm trying to figure out when I can get that done. I have no clue how I'm going to do my hair for Sunday. But this, today is going to be the wrap up of um, this vlog. I don't know if I'm going to vlog my clients today only because it's a short day. I'm not really feeling great. So I don't think I am. I think we're just going to end the vlog here. But... <clears throat> But Sunday will be fun. That's going to be, I think I might do it as its own separate vlog with the photo shoot. And just, you know, even if it's like something cute and short, just like a behind the scenes. Um, I do have to go grab the girls because um, I'm going to do mimosas. And I'm going, going to do um, like bagels and cream cheese and maybe some fruit. Just for them to snack on something before we go in and something light so they don't feel like bloated or anything before their um, pictures same for myself i also have to get the steamer from my cousin because one of my dresses needs to be steamed and actually now that i'm thinking about it i also gotta remember to take the dresses that i have at home for my second look out so i can bring them so and i have to get my shoes out of the storage unit so I still got a lot to do and I'm glad I said all of that because I'm going to make a list and check it off as I go so I don't forget anything. It just doesn't help that today's rainy. I'm going to get ready, but I'm going to close out this vlog. I will see you guys in the next one and thanks for watching.